Okay, we just finished Gurren Lagann. And I am sad. I, I don't want it to be done. Yeah. I, I always tell them, like, things with anime, like, it's always sad that they finish. But, I mean, it sounds cliche, but you gotta be happy that it happened. I liked Gurren Lagann a lot. And it was a good anime. I say that about every anime. <laughs> yeah, he kind of likes every anime he watches. I thought he would like this because it's very shonen where... I would say... Because it's a shonen anime, like... Uh, everyone is just powering up. Like, there were so many times where... Like, uh, Gurren Lagann, it was Gurren and then Lagann. And then it was Gurren Lagann. And then it was Dai Gurren Lagann. Super Dairen... Guy... Dai... Oh, God. Super Dai Gurren, Ultra uh, Dai Gurren, Ultra Gurren Lagan, Galaxy Gurren Lagan. That's what I mean by showing it. He just kept powering up. Okay, so would you recommend Gurren Lagan? Yes. I would. It's good. <laughs> <laughs> I would say watch it if you want to. I don't care. It's it's a good anime. You should watch it. That's what you should say. It's a good anime. You should watch it. Now, if I'm being personally being picky about a Gurren Lagann, like I said, it's a very shonen. It's a very power up, almost like Dragon Ball. I personally would give it a four out of five because I thought the characters are great. Not all the characters were great. Um, the story was kind of complicated in the way that it was like their power ups here. It was like, wow, we're just going to power up. And then there's parts of the story where there's this villain, the moon villain, Lord Genome, the Beast Man. I mean, it almost feels like there was like no structure really. Okay, what I'm saying is I think there are better anime like Demon Slayer, if you're newer to anime, or like Black Clover, where I feel like the story is simpler, but it has more structure to it. Instead of like, I mean, Black Clover does do this sometimes where they just, they just power up. Asta does push-ups and sit-ups, so he's physically strong, so he can hold his demon sword. In Gurren Lagann, it's like, oh, the more spirit, the more energy, now the more power. Or it's kind of like fairy tale, like the power of friendship makes you stronger. That's what I mean. Okay, Anti-Spiral, my favorite. They um, were pretty cool. Uh, Simon, also my favorite. I did. I really like Simon. How he I changed. I also liked Viru. He's he's a good character. I, he really changed. And the fact that like Nia disappears at the end, and <laughs> then the last shot we see is Simone older with a kid that is also trying to drill. That was pretty cool to see him older, even though he looked really old. Even though he, he was like be. in his twenties. So he should be when like forty. When all this happened, he should be at like forty. Yeah. Yeah, and he looked like sixty. Those <laughs> the time skips though, mm, like they were really long. They took a lot of time from the <laughs> anime. I mean, this guy's also watched Black Clover, so he thinks six months is a long time. And watch One Piece. No, which... six months isn't even that long. I know, but I'm saying six months is not long. Two years, I think, in One Piece was a good time. Seven years was... I think it was a good time for Gurren Lagann because they changed all of society. But like I said last time, there were some people I didn't even know who, who were the old people. Yeah, like we said before, I think it was our reaction to the seven year time skip a lot of people changed like they just looked a lot different simone looked he was so tall he, he didn't look like a little kid at all anymore simone i believe i i talked about this in like another youtube short where i was talking about people that have uh conquer saki i after watching all of grown log on i think that simone and kamina would both have conquer saki because i believe they both have the king desire to be the best and everyone wants to follow them. Uh, I was also gonna say that I really like, um, even though Kamina died, what, like episode 12 or 13 or whatever, even at the end of like episode 25 or 26, whenever it was, everyone gets stuck in that dream place 
that galaxy dream. See, uh, not Simon. Kamina was still there to push everyone. And that's what I mean by like a king. He still has, he still has that thing about him where he just inspires everyone. Yeah. And it was really cool to see. It was really cool because he was like, you guys are not staying here. You yeah. guys have to go fight. Also, I gotta say the opening, pretty fire. I know. I love the opening. I'm sad that there wasn't any other openings besides just like visual changes. This guy wants, every time we're watching One Piece, we're on, we just start a new opening. This guy immediately goes, okay, when's the next opening? So he's very picky about openings. Personally, I love Gurren Lagann's opening. It probably is one of my favorite openings just because, I don't know, I just, I just love it. Yeah. I think the also the biggest part we're missing, it's very heavy into mech anime stuff. So if you like mech anime, I think you would like this, especially <laughs> when we were making a joke earlier that uh, there's a part where uh, Simone has drills on the Gurren Lagann. And even the drills have little drills, and those little drills have drills. I I was actually thinking of the I was like, the drills have drills that have drills that have drills, and it just keeps going until they make more drills. Yeah, I believe that Gurren Lagann also has some of the best quotes. Like one of my favorite quotes is, um, "Don't believe in yourself because if you're like, um, if you don't really believe in yourself that much." But believe in the me that believes in you. Yeah. So uh, Kamina would say that to Simone all the time because Simone was very, especially when he was young, he was just very scared of everything. But Kamina believed in him, so it's it's a nice quote. Yeah. Believe in the you that believes in me. Yeah. But then at the he, end... He, he used to always change it up, too. Yeah, but I was going to say at the end, he did change it. He... he he got even more serious. He said, "You." Sh he just changed it to pretty much, you should believe in yourself. Yeah, don't believe in the me that believes in you. Believe in the you that believes in yeah. you. Yeah, just to get really deep down into it. Also, I really love the uh, Pierce Through the Heavens just because it's almost like that other quote where it's like, aim for the heavens and then reach the stars. Yeah. Or be among the stars. So you're still great no matter what. Yeah, it's a really good quote. Mm, I don't know if it's the best quotes because it, what... It's just good quotes. Well, uh, yeah, I was going to say one of my favorite anime quotes is when uh, Yami's talking to Asta. And Yami tells Asta, uh, you have to surpass your limits right here, right now. Yeah, it's, and, that's a good quote. It's so, it's so dumb, but it's so funny. It's, it's so funny. I tell myself, <laughs> I used to tell myself that all the time. When I yeah, watch Black Clover. Surpass your limits plus ultra. <laughs> Yo, we combine my hero and uh, Black, Black Clover. Clover. It was funny. Okay, final thoughts. Like I said, I recommend Gurren Lagann. I thought it's it's still no matter what you believe in, though, it's very shonen. It's still great anime, especially about believing in yourself. Yeah, it's it's really good. I, re I recommend. He recommends. I would say it's a good anime. You should go watch it. Definitely. All right, go watch Grand Lagon. So make sure you leave a like if you enjoyed it. Leave a comment and tell us if you've watched Grand Lagon. Do you like it? Where you would rate it? Don't forget to subscribe, ring the bell, and we, me and probably Aaron, will see you next time. And then me and Aaron do we do a fist pump. There you go. <laughs>